Hi everyone, this is our video of Sequoia National Park in late October 2022. Please click like on our video and subscribe to our YouTube channel. And also please leave us a comment as we really value your feedback. This road trip was mainly in California and we are now driving on State Route 178. We started our drive today from Lone Pine and our destination is the Lazy J Ranch Motel in Three Rivers. The road to the giant trees is very windy and takes some time to drive. If it wasn't signposted, we would have thought we were on the wrong road, as there are no signs of any sequoias until the last part. The giant sequoias grow only on the western slopes of the Sierra Nevada mountain range, at between 4,000 and 8,000 feet. Giant sequoias are the most massive trees in the world. They grow to an average height of 160 to 280 feet, with trunk diameters ranging from 20 to 25 feet. We are now approaching Tunnel Log, where you can drive your car through a fallen sequoia and see firsthand the 21 foot wide trunk. This giant sequoia fell in 1937 across Crescent Meadow Road. Rather than go to the trouble of chopping the tree apart, the Park Service wisely decided to bore an 8 foot high and 17 foot wide hole through the middle and created a tourist attraction. Sequoia trees are one of the largest living species on earth and can grow to an age of 3,000 years and over. The only tree that beats that age is the ancient bristle cone in the White Mountains of California. Watch out for our forthcoming video of the ancient bristle cone pine forest. Driving through this forest and experiencing its ancient grandeur is a feast for the senses. The trees have stood here silent and noble for thousands of years. Make sure you take a walk through them, touch the bark and give them a hug. As we drive through the forest, you may have seen some fire damaged trees. Fire plays a crucial role in the giant sequoia's ecosystem. The trees are adapted to periodic fire. Sequoia bark, which can be 18 inches thick, protects the tree and also insulates from the heat. When fire burns the forest floor, it dries out the sequoia cones, which causes them to open and release their seeds. This is an ideal time for regeneration success. We are now at General Sherman Tree Car Park. There is a half a mile downhill hike to reach the tree, with some stairs and paved pathways. General Sherman is estimated to be between 2,300 and 2,700 years old. Just think about that. It would have been seeded around 700 to 300 BC. The tree stands 275 feet in height and has a diameter at base of 36 feet. Before you hike back up the hill to the car park, take a walk around the giant forest sequoia grove to see all the exhibits which explain the natural history of the sequoia trees. When you walk back up the hill, take it easy. The air is thin at 7,000 feet and the path is steep in places. There are benches along the way for you to take a rest. We have spent the whole day in this unforgettable, awesome forest. And now we are heading back to our motel. 
We stayed in Three Rivers at the Lazy J Ranch. We had a self-catering cabin with two large beds. All you need for a comfortable stay. Please don't forget to click like, subscribe to our YouTube channel and leave us a comment. And thanks for watching.